I met up with Guzzi and his views for the club and the way he sold it. It really appealed to me and the way I play and really felt like there was a, a place for me in the team. So, you know, it was a bit of a, a, a no-brainer. Started playing rugby about seven at my local club, Jed Forest. Rugby's massive in my area, so uh, just got into it and been playing ever since. When I was really young, I was a winger. As I kind of moved to 15s, I went to fullback. I won't say I was that good. Uh, and then luckily when I was about 15, I grew a bit and they put me in sec uh, second row and you know, it kind of worked out a bit better for me. About 17-ish, when I, when I first got picked up in the Newcastle Academy and that. You know, I enjoyed my rugby, but I wasn't expecting it. I was doing an apprenticeship at the time in uh, mechanical engineering. So I was just kind of focused on that. Obviously, I worked hard on my rugby, just because that was just kind of what I did. Like, I, I never thought it would be a job. But then, obviously, when I got uh, offered my contract in Newcastle, I kind of thought, you know, you must be doing something all right. So I was uh, over the moon. <laughs> One each, watch! Just because it's a good technique, that's all. I like, obviously love the sport, but I think when you're off the field and that, you, you make such a good group of mates. It's just good fun and good boys to be around. I think I made my debut about 18 and then I didn't play for a while after that. I think, obviously, it's, it's a great life. I think... Uh, Breaking my Champions Cup debut against Toulon. We played them away and uh, beat them, which was, was a pretty special moment. But you know, it's a massive step up. You've just got to adapt it quickly or else you're out the door. So, you know, you've got to get used to it. It's, it's like a bug once you, get, once you get your first game or something, you just want to play more and more, especially in front of like big crowds and that, because you get that buzz and it's hard to replicate. It's been really exciting. I've never lived further away than Newcastle, so it's uh, it's a lot further south than I'm used to. But uh, it's a lot more expensive than I'm used to. But uh, nah, it's good fun. It's obviously, everything's new. You know, getting a bit of London, there's so much to do. I think everyone's ready to go now. Everybody's kind of tuned for a game. Just want to push on, get as much game time as I can. Coming in, it's kind of like a line-out call, or maybe take control of that a bit. And then I think for the team, you know, we've got ambitions because he, he doesn't shy away from saying that he wants to be pushing up to win trophies, win the league. So, you know, set the standards high. <laughs>